guys, Crystal here and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are going to continue our Christmas vlog and this is going to be the part two and it is all about the small details of our Christmas decorations inside our home, like our kitchen, our stairs, and some small details that we are going to put here in our house. So join me in this vlog doing this project and let's finish this today. Okay guys, so now we are here and ito na aking mga kailangan for today's uh, decoration here. Well actually, not only this kasi si husband is gagawin niya yung stairs and the railings. Siya ang bahala doon at mag-vlog siya ng sarili niya. That's his first time. Ang gagawin ko today is ang centerpiece natin and then small details in the kitchen. That's my baby. And small details in the kitchen and some Christmas decorations that I'm going to put in that cabinet there at the back. Are you okay babe? Yeah. To say hi to the vlog first. <laughs> so now let's start this thing. Para matapos tayong maanga at makalabas kami today. I'm gonna remove this here. Para naman may space ako. So I am. So first, center piece. Hi. So eto, meron ako nito. Pinili ko to last year and ganito na siya. Ang dinagdag ko lang is itong mga Christmas uh, little Christmas balls dito. And yeah, ang gagawin ko isa lalagay ko siya sa gitna, the centerpiece. <laughs> Ilalagay ko siya sa gitna, the centerpiece and magdadagdag tayo ng mga candles and mga kung ano pa para magmukha siyang maganda. Yeah. So this thing I think it's going to that cabinet there. Ito yung ginawa ko last year. Pinapart ko sila sa isang box para hindi masira. Tsaka pinastik ko sila ng ganyan. Para mabilis mong ma-recognize na oh, this is for centerpiece and the other one is for the kitchen. Para mabilis ko bilos. Where did we put this last year? So I'm not mistaken. These right here, um, they go here. <laughs> I just made this ribbons here. I forgot. Oh, in the refrigerator. My memory. When you have two kids, how many? Two. <laughs> you have two kids is a problem. It's affecting your memory. Right? I have six and uh, And then you're done. They're not complaining. <laughs> yeah, they have six and they're not complaining. Their memory is so good. So, um, this one, why is just now like dripping? So this three here, I bought this at the thrift store and uh, I just painted it and just put some you know, decors and that. Usually, um, we can put candles inside. It's up to you guys if you whatever you want. But for me, last year I just put candles, the artificial candles, not the real candles. So this one here is a very classic uh, thing that we are like, you know, majority of us always put in the center of the table. I want to use this every Christmas season because it does really give Christmas vibes, you know. So we are going to put that here in the center. And this one here is going to be in the center of the table. And you know what guys, so these three candles here, they're really pretty and have like this Christmas fragrance, you know. But what happened is I put three of these candles together all in one box and when we put this in the attic and it kind of melted, it looked, it ruined the candles, but whatever, I'm still gonna use this because it's really pretty. You can really smell, hi mama. You can really smell crisp. I'm sorry with my daughter. It is super loud. Right? And she wanna get out. So now the next thing is to put these candles. Like this is the candle holder and I have here the candles. But we are going to put in the center of the table or that I am going to put in the center of the table. So this is going to be really nice. So what you can do is probably um... Okay. We can go get some other candy. Yeah, or we can put something in the bottom. Like make it like stand. There you go. Good job. So, yep, so this is advent candle. This one is melted. It's okay here. No, I like I like the smell of that one. <laughs> Get rid of it. <laughs> this is pine cones and I am going to add this in here just to add scent on the table and also just to add like accent to on our cider piece. You notice I have it here, but that is like the artificial one. <laughs> no scent. They usually tied it in there, but I'm just not gonna do it anymore. I'll just put that in here. Yeah. 
The smell of this is really good. Like you can really smell the Christmas. I love the smell of this pine. But the thing is you have to put them together, like all of them, so the smell gets like in one place. Yeah, it's not gonna smell the same. So that's one down. And I have this one here. Vincent is so afraid of this one, even Kristen. This is Santa Pig, and then when you press it, see? He is so afraid of this. So now we are done with our centerpiece. And then I'm going to move on to our kitchen and start decorating our kitchen too. For now, I'm moving on to the kitchen and we are going to fix this and put some decorations in this area here and on that cabinet there. And let's begin! So this one here is going to be in our refrigerator. Alright guys, so now I am moving on to this Christmas stockings here. And we are going to put this on top of the cabinets, but I'm like thinking, how am I going to do that? I don't want to put hole in the cabinet. And also I don't have double-sided tape. So now I came up with this idea. I'm just going to put like string here. We're just going to hook it. Alikod ng cabinets natin siya. Ilalagay. So let's do this now. So that's all the stockings and I'm going to put up some Christmas decorations in that door and there's an empty one there, space, and that one I guess I can't reach that cabinet that's really high. So let's see what I can do with that one. Okay guys, so let's continue decorating. Alright guys, so now I am trying to make this one here and then I am going to put this in our pantry door to give more colors in our kitchen. Decorating for Christmas is a lot of work. Oh my goodness, my baby is kind of crying. And my husband is decorating upstairs too. He's in charge of the railings and the stairs. I feel like eating unhealthy food today because of all the work. I miss eating burger actually. It's not bad if you're gonna eat it once in a while. All they said once a month or twice a month is fine. So this is going to be in our pantry door. All right, guys. Now we are done with our pantry door decoration, and then now we are going to move on to the living room. So let's go and finish this project. All right, guys. I'm back. So I just put my baby in bed, and then Vincent and Isaiah went to his dad to drop off something. And now we are going to continue this project. Like what I said, we have to finish this today. So I am going to decorate this cabinet here and give some Christmas stuff vibe. So last year I did not put this in here because I used that one for the entry table, but I think the entry table now is fine. I don't need any decorations because I have two Christmas trees in both sides. So I think that's fine. This one guys is almost done, but the thing is I don't have this little thing for porcelain. I'm gonna buy that later, but I have to move on to the next one. So this is gonna be easy because this one is just to put something in that. They're so cute, right? I love this one here and Vincent like this. All right guys, so now I am done with that part of our house, the living room, and now I'm going to move on to this wall. I need to put two screws on that side. So now we are done in this side and now we are going upstairs to complete the decorations of the garland. Just put some Christmas balls and the ribbons and after that I am going to rest. So I've been assigned to install what I think is called a garland. So similar to the Christmas tree you know, once you put this stuff on and you start kind of fluffing it up and you know bending these outwards and making it 
a little bit nicer, you know, so they can cover the rail. It's gonna look pretty nice. Cable ties. They work perfectly. I got them black so you don't see them, and they're a little bit you know, hidden. And then once it's all up, then you just go with some pair of scissors and put the, uh, the excess off, and you're good to go. So we got this little piece right here that uh, obviously this little 11 inch strap doesn't fit around the whole pulse. So what we can do is easily just uh, combine two of them together and just fish it through. The idea is to kind of just, if you can hide the strap as much as possible, that's, that's the ideal thing. Not so bad. I mean, once we start folding everything out, you, know, you can hide the straps a little bit better. We're going to go ahead and do all the rails here, all the top. There's another rail that goes across there, and so once it's all lit up and covered up, it's going to look really nice. So, let's get to it. Alright, so it's pretty much done. And that's how it is. I think it looks great. Okay guys, so now we are here upstairs and we are going to start putting some decorations here. I am going to do that right now. And I'm going to be a lot bit off of right now. They're all happy. Magligpit kaysa ilagay ang mga decorations. Kaya talaga ang aking dream is magkaroon ng malaking malaking Christmas tree uh, doon sa luma naming bahay. But naisip ko na maging ba mas decorate. Ano guys, pinabara ko talaga ng parents to be full. Alam nyo naman guys, ang mga retirees dapat yan ay nag-enjoy na lang sa buhay o magtrabaho. Pero yung mamay ko kasi may store sila. So yun yung pinagkakaapalahan niya ngayon. And at the same time, alam mo na, may pension din sila, pero may income pa rin sila sa store. Pili nila nagkatrabaho pa rin sila. Yun, ang plan na namin duwin sila once na maayos na ang lahat. And then, last step na talaga to. So, itong ribbons na to, ginawa ko siya. Ay, balik tayo. Ito, itong ribbons na to, ginawa ko to para sa other um, work. So, I decided to put this one over here. And I love how it looks. Yes, Alright guys, so I'm going to end this vlog here and thank you so much for watching this part 2 of our Christmas vlog and for the part 3 is going to be decorating our front yard so I'm really excited to decorate that with you guys so please subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet and give this video thumbs up if you end up liking this video I hope to see you guys in my next video stay safe, spread the love and God bless you all Bye